drugs that choke the vein. I grew up in a family band and we would tour every summer and you know, pile five kids and my parents into a big club wagon van and tour around playing bluegrass music. Um, everywhere from like New York to Seattle, Texas, we covered some ground. I've never tried drugs that choke the vein. Yeah, my, my parents, when they started having kids, decided that they themselves wanted to be musicians. And so they started learning and teaching their kids. And so we all grew together. For many years, we were terrible. We were a very awful, like, family jug band-esque. Like, just, we played on the street in, in like, touristy towns. taught us all violins. So it was five kids playing violin and an upright bass and guitar. And it was five very out of tune violins for a while. It's kind of, it's been um, not ingrained, just kind of born along with us that it'll always be, it'll always be the other half of, of life. You know? But music is just, it, it never leaves, so we're all addicted. I've been playing the mandolin since 2001. I'm self-taught. Um, I guess I like the instrument because I got it for free, and that's why I decided to learn it, because I had one. It's, it's really similar to the violin, which I also play, which helps. It's probably my favorite instrument to play. I started the violin when I was two, and although I started just bowing on a book at that age, and then started on a 32nd size violin and moved on up, so it's been 19 years. And although I haven't played it much in recent years since I've been picking up other instruments, it's still the deepest rooted one. Playing the guitar now for six years. I'm also self-taught, and I mostly play it to just songwrite. It's the easiest instrument for that. Until you've earned someone as your fan, they're not your fan. There's how many bands in Iowa City, and you know, the, the typical I'm in a band thing doesn't inspire that your band is very good. And by no means does saying that your band is good prove that your band is good. So you either have to win on charisma or character and just tell the people that you know, you're gonna have a good time and it's gonna be a fun event and they should come check it out. So what more, you guys know when we come and play that the in-between songs is actually a lot like speed dating. It's real quick tidbits about us. You guys shout stuff out, we look at you, we're, we're assessing you. 
and then hopefully we'll go home with you at the end of the night. Sweet day. Right, well, come on. All right.